What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Marcus the Boss. And today we have it is here, it is upon us. Gen 8 and U Alpha. And as you can see on the screen, I got a match against my boy K. Um I don't know what to say. I mean I could go over some team stuff right now. Uh let me open the thing right now. So Arctovish is here, and both Arctovish and Arctosil dropped. Surprise not at least one of them had the usage to stay are you probably are the Zolt because I would say I would imagine that people on might have used that a little bit more Vika Volt gets webs now surprised that didn't say up Gore guys it's pretty good you don't know which Gore guys it is you have right on right on's still good that's a classic Hitmonchan we have like no hazard control we have Hitmonchan we have Mr. Mime over here Hitmon top is here Vullaby for defog Unpheasant can defog, Noctowl can defog, but it doesn't have Tinted Lens anymore. I'm trying to think, there's probably some other things. If you really want Magic Bounce, we only have like Natu and Hatram, so not a whole lot. Probably one of the spinners I'm not thinking of. Girder, who was actually two weeks into it, projected to drop, was actually like barely over. It barely rose up to RU. That would have been a defogger now. So yeah, not a lot of hazard control. Hitmonchan is still serviceable. Mr. Mime serviceable. Those, that's probably top two at this point. I'd imagine Unpheasant can be pretty good too with Defog. And then Ice Q. We know what Ice Q does. And belly Drums. Ice Q's kind of... It's designed rather poorly, some would say. It's weird. It's a weird Pokemon. That's all I have to say about it. It's weird. And it's base 50. I always get that mixed up with that. It's not base 60. I used to always do that in my... Uh, are you bows and people would have this in or beetle without run anyway on my side i can tell you all my sets i have gorgeis it's gorgeis super it's choice band it's not the only one of its set variant in this video i'll spoil that right now and garbador it's a spiker of course because there's not really a lot of hazard control but no spin block oh actually gorgeis is a spin blocker never mind the lantern it's av classic set more room for Ice Beam, or more room for Thunderbolt, stuff like that, because no more Hidden Power, which would be a decent move on it, in Power Grass, you get Other Lantern, and some Water Grounds, who aren't even here. Sandaconda, it's Coil, it's also the Rocker, because I don't have one. I believe in Sandaconda, like I believe in Orbeetle. Sandaconda's pretty good. It's pretty nice defensively. Um, what am I trying to say? I was thinking about offensive variants, but at that point, Silverly Ground, with the new buff multi-attack, might as well use that. We got Lyper, it's also Choice Band. No more knockoff, but you do have Throw Chop, that's pretty serviceable as well. Sucker Punch, despite being banded again. Because I also lost Pursuit on that mod, so I'm going Sucker Punch, Throw Chop, and then the same U turn player off. Could probably put Trick somewhere on there over Sucker Punch, maybe. And then Mr. Mime Galar, despite being an NFP, I still have the Heavy Duty Boots instead of a Violite. Nasty Plot, Focus Blast, Freeze Dry Spin, I use it a couple of times. I think more than once in an RU video or two. But let's just get into the match. So we got a Rhydon versus Santa Conda lead match. This is favorable for me, but we're just trading rocks. I probably could have gotten a coil and gotten away with it. My only attacking move is Earthquake because I needed that to be a rocker. As Vikavolt's heavy duty boots. Lantern really the only, the only thing taking the hit. I get it in before the web, so I am still faster. I do scald for a clean three hit. He's not Roost because he's probably Scald dual stab or energy ball dual stab and web so he takes the kill there Mr. Mime Galar comes in for the freeze dry and this is actually looking pretty threatening to his squad it's not gonna Oko ride on so I go back to Santa Condo which is slower than ride on now thanks to the, the thing I could have went Gorgeist and just gotten a free power whip probably but yeah he goes to his Gorgeist super frisks my leftovers I'm going for a uh, rest just to heal myself back up. I could have coiled, but there's a Gorgeist on the screen still, I'm like near full. I go to Garbodor, but he is choice man power with. Gets the crit, and I'm like, I eat the next one, and just pain split it all back, but unfortunately he crits me again, double crit. I mean, we'll take all that recoil you want to put onto yourself, I'll take that. But it is kind of upsetting that that crit did in fact happen. I could have play roughed or U-turned here, and gotten away with it, but I sucker punched. Hadn't registered to me that he was CB just yet. I go to my own Gorgeist, which is also CB, like I said. Frisk the orb. He goes for Throw Chop. Doesn't even do half, despite me not being really defensive at all. I do have HP, though. So there's that. Sneak attacks on 54, but I think at this point, I probably just lose to 
his his Gorgeist anyway. I go to Liper, bad play because, yeah, I forgot about the web. That would have been a sucker punch either way, or without the web, but because I forgot about it, we can't do that. He goes for Drain Punch, and I need Sandicana to wake up sooner rather than later. Luckily, it wakes up right there, so I can eat the next Drain Punch pretty handily and then finish him with Earthquake, and the chance of me getting the W here is higher than zero. He goes to Ice Q after this, but I'm going to drop Ice Q on his neck with this next play. I go Hard Mime because if he attacks, it's I. Because I'm not going to get O-Code by an unboosted Ice Q, despite Mr. Mime's physical bulk being a little disappointing. I just kill him with Focus Blast. Forget about the Ice Face, but because he's CB, he does just win the game with Shadow Sneak. And, uh, Santa Connor not eating that either, so that's going to do it. Great game, pretty good, solid match to start us off. Start off the Showdown series in Gen 8 and you, and that will be the video. See you guys in the next one.